Ugh, gotta go get another COVID test. I mean, it's not like I've been doing anything crazy lately, but I don't know, I felt kind of sick yesterday. Like I was getting a fever and I just kind of had that flu feeling and I thought, well, by golly, I better go get tested. I mean, it's free and I, you know, I was able to book a next day appointment. Uh, it's only like 15 minutes from my house. No excuse, especially because, well, I had plans to meet up with my sister. Oh gosh, in about 10 days. Uh, that's right, my sister, who I used to travel around with quite a bit, is finally done with her nanny gig. Woohoo! <laughs> she was working as a nanny for the entire last year, and well, basically it was a 24 seven job, so she couldn't come visit me, we couldn't go travel together, go really have any kind of adventures. Well, that's all changed now, and watch out! My sister's back and there's gonna be adventure. Hey la, hey la, my sister's back. Just cruising through Vegas on a sunny Friday morning, early spring. Testing site is right down here at UNLV. And there in front of us, you see the world famous Las Vegas Strip, all scrubbed up and dressed up and well, ready to go, but nowhere to go yet. I think they're gonna open all the pool parties and stuff back up here in the next few weeks, so. It's interesting, I mean, I sort of felt like, oh, okay, pandemic's over, you know, numbers of infection are down. I don't really know too many people who are sick right now, if any, uh, and, well, they're <laughs> reopening the pool clubs, you know, those giant pool day clubs where people go hang out and wallow in each other's bodily fluids? <laughs> well, by gum, if the government thinks it's safe to do that, <laughs> I figured I was okay. Well, I didn't even really do anything. I only talked to a very few people this last week. I've been staying at home, learning how to use this new editing software, taking care of some ho homeowner business. I've been very boring lately, and I can't imagine how I might have contracted COVID. But hey, gotta be safe for my sister, so I'm gonna go get checked. Oh, I can make this light. Oh, this is kind of interesting. This is the new Virgin Hotel. It used to be the Hard Rock, but Richard Branson bought it and turned it into the Virgin Hotel. It's not open yet, but I've seen photos of the interior and it's friggin' beautiful. Can't wait till all this is over and I can go check it out. Oh, there's the Hofbrau house. <laughs> Eins, zwei, zufa! <laughs> oh, I guess it's closed if you can see the sign there. It's cute, it says. Be kind, wear masks, stay safe. We will prost again soon. And then on the other side of the street there, uh, well, there's a white castle, but, and then there's a giant Dunkin' Donuts. Behind that, there's the Holiday Royale Residences. It's like a weekly apartment place. I actually lived there once <laughs> for about a week while I was looking for an apartment. Wasn't too bad, and I'm glad to see the old gal still standing. Okay, let's see. Thomas and Mac Drive, where is that? Oh, right here. Okie dokie. Okay, here we are. Where is the COVID testing? I came here before and did it. You think I'd remember? Ah, they don't let you take any uh, photos or video inside the testing place, but well, if you've done it before, <laughs> you know what it is. You stick a Q-tip up each nostril and <laughs> dig it around 15 times on each side. And well, by gum, uh, it was a very different testing experience. Last time I got tested was in December and they had it over in this friggin' basketball arena and they were just churning through people. They didn't even ask if you had insurance. Now the numbers are a lot smaller. Uh, so I did have to provide insurance information. Supposedly I won't be charged any kind of copay. We'll see about that, Sierra Health and Life. And I don't know how long it'll take to get my results. I mean, 
used to only be like a day or two. But hopefully it comes back negative so I can go meet up with my sister for some good times in the middle of nowhere. Okay, now I'm gonna go home, finish drinking my coffee, and edit this video using my brand new fancy big girl editing software.